Good morning. Oh. Our, our, uh. One way to wake up. <laughs> uh, okay. So, uh, yes, that is, that is one way to wake up. Uh, we're gonna say goodbye to, to Turd's house. Uh, Turd can stay here. Um, you'll notice that, uh, my level has, has gone up. And that is because I decided nobody wants to watch a whole bunch of mining and shopping. So what I did was I spent the last three days in game days and I mined up a ton of stone and I crafted the, uh, where is it here? The masonry bench. And I made a whole bunch of uh, pieces to make a temporary stone house we are no longer going to be cave dwellers uh, we're gonna live next to a cave down by the, the little creek down that way and we are going to uh, maybe do a little cave exploring after we get some of that done and it's moving day basically so let's see here uh, oh and uh, apparently every few days you get attacked by a bunch of rats. So I came out here, I was gonna go grab some wood, and there were four Drax hanging out over here, and uh, they jumped me uh, right before logging off. Oh. Yep. No more. We're, we're gonna say goodbye to these worms. Uh, they're terrible housemates, and they constantly interrupt me. So let's just throw what we don't need in here. Take this, this, throw that in there, throw that down there. You can see where I killed a bunch of pigs and got my favorite food, bacon. Any more? No? Okay. And we're just going to see what we can do here. Cool. Don't need you, don't need you, don't need you. Grab enough of that. And go in here. Don't need that. Just raw food. So we are light. Oh, and that first mission, by the way, gives you that obsidian pickaxe. It is awesome. Um, actually, really awesome. 30% um, chance to smelt when mining. So as you're mining, you actually get full-blown ingots. Not just the iron ore. So that is awesome. Let's see if we can carry all of this. Yeah. Uh, no, we can't. But you know what? I will see you down there. And we will uh, take a peek at all that I've done. See you soon. Bye, cave. Okay, and uh, welcome back. Down at the uh, Crick Cave entrance. And you can see behind me is all of the stone. That back row is all stone, and this front row is all wood. And there's actually a bunch of stone and wood over there, too. And what we're going to do here is we're going to set up a quick little bridge. And uh, our little temporary stone hut. So that way we can uh, bring some of the workbenches down, some of the storage down. And actually uh, have a little bit more fun and, like I said, spend a lot less time mining uh, on screen. So, here we go. Level ground. We've got... I think we're going to shoot for... 
right about here, where that stone is, we're going to set down our first little... Yep, and then we're going to actually go straight across there. I'm going to go there, there, there. Alright, good, you're not going to break. And... Some of these bad boys. Come on, baby. Okay. So there's our bridge. We'll have to get one more piece there, and we we'll might even put some stairs on this side. And then uh, our little temporary hut. I like windows, so we're going to push these out over. Windows. There. there. Put our door here. And of course, that went the wrong way. Door. You go that way. Oh. Oh. and grab the other one. Okay. Did you look at that? Got a way out of planning. Got everything except the door. So this is now our safe room down here and we are going to go ahead and bring down our benches yeah. okay something's down there something bad
and boom. Now we have all of our stuff down here in our new structure next to a water source. Speaking of which, I am thirsty. Aha! Uh -huh. And it's a sign I didn't get diarrhea from drinking from this creek. So, uh, welcome to our new home. It, uh, oops. It looks awesome. And, uh, of course, just like in real life, whenever you move, there is a storm. But if we take a look here and look at the damage, there isn't any. Now, stone structures do take some damage during some storms. But we're talking 50 points out of 2,500 versus a wooden structure, which every storm you're going to be sitting here and just beating on it with a hammer. Uh, it's it's just really not a fun way to play, in my opinion. I do like the mechanic, but uh, not something that uh, everyone wants to be doing the whole time. So what we're going to do is, uh, like I said, today was moving day. Um, I do want to take the opportunity and, and very quickly actually go and do uh, that cave over there just to kind of see what's in there. We're, we're going to just make sure we throw down everything that we don't need. Start putting stuff in the right benches. And throw the bacon that we got in there. And we're going to just real quick, like I said, just run and go do one of those caves. And we will call it an episode. Right. Meet you over there. Alright, so here we are. Uh, if anyone's interested, this is where we are on the map. I-6. And we're going to uh, do a little spelunking. Nice little cave we got here. And of course, much needed iron. And as you can see there over on the right, uh, this one, like I said, has a chance to smelt the ore. And of course, the smelted ore has less weight. Oh, there's our level 19. And with that less weight means that we are able to more quickly not only mine, but also bring back more ore. And at level 20, we will be able to get into some rifles and ammunition. We got a little bit left. And all right. Nobody saw that. We are actually going to leave it here today. 
Like I said, today was moving day, get everything moved, and just a quick in and out on this cave. I'm going to get all this stuff back home, and uh, I will see you guys next time. I really appreciate anyone that kept watching. Uh, if you, if you like this video, or if you'd like to see something else, let me know. I really appreciate it. Thanks so much.